Honda is, is pretty content with the current direction that GF5 has been going. And in fact, at this point in time, it looks like we'll accept GF5 uh, as is without any Honda specifications on top of that. Uh, regarding the GF5 need statement, the, I think the two critical issues, uh, well, primarily is fuel economy, uh, and after that would be emission system protection. Uh, on the last issue, uh, here at least in California, we have some pretty draconian re regulations coming out uh, pretty soon from the ARB, uh, specifically Lab 3, so emission system protection is important. Um, of course, oil robustness is also important, but we realize it's, in, it's uh, very difficult to include that in the formulation uh, as well. We know that some OEMs uh, will be uh, releasing uh, quite a bit of uh, direct injection technology, turbocharger technology, so uh, oil robustness can't be ignored. You know, Honda plans to move to a Zerto B20 viscosity grade uh, pretty rapidly. Um, for example, a new Insight was the first vehicle actually uh, certified using Zerto B20. And within a few years, uh, essentially all of our vehicles, Honda and Acura, will uh, recommend Zerto B20 exclusively, aside from a few, uh, a few niche vehicles. Uh, we also plan to recommend uh, Zerto B20 retroactively uh, to vehicles uh, all back to about model year 2001, at least for some vehicles. Uh, so within a relatively short length of time, we'll have about 10 million Honda and Acura vehicles on the market that can recommend Zer W20. Uh, we have absolutely no concern whatsoever with where with Zer W20. Uh, we've been using this viscosity grade in the Japanese and European markets uh, all the way back to 2001. And uh, of course, uh, all of these vehicles were purposely designed to run on Zer W20 or even lower viscosity grades. Honda thinks there's, there's still room to improve fuel economy by uh, decreasing oil viscosity. In fact, uh, in Japan, the Honda has developed a uh, 0W10 uh, oil. In fact, some of it's being used as factory fill for vehicles that uh, are imported to the, to the U.S. market. Uh, of course, durability is absolutely no concern. These vehicles and engines were designed for this very low viscosity grade. Um, Honda is actively working w with the uh, industry uh, consortium to address the changes needed to SAE J300 uh, to accommodate these lo very low viscosity oils. Uh, now, one challenge with low viscosity oils is, is uh, there is some uh, consumers that don't completely understand uh, what the zero refers to. Uh, specifically, of course, it refers to a temperature scale. Uh, there is, for example, some perception that means zero viscosity. So I think we do have a little bit of uh, consumer education to do.